Hi, I'm Laurie Thomas with the University of Kentucky Forestry and Natural Resource Extension, and I'm here with the tree of the week, the yellowwood. Yellowwood, Cladrastis kentuckia, is a relatively rare tree. It is also known as American yellowwood and Kentucky yellowwood. It is in the Fabaceae or legume family, and there is only one species of yellowwood in North America. All other species of Cladrastis are found in Asia. Yellowwood is a beautiful medium-sized deciduous tree with a vase-like form. The tree grows between 30 and 50 feet tall. The tree can live to 100 years of age. And it's a wonderful landscape or specimen tree because of its fragrant showy flowers, attractive fall color, and stout round canopy. It typically forks repeatedly and develops a broad rounded crown in full sun and tends to develop U-shaped crotches at offshoot branches, which can break and cause the tree to split apart if not regularly pruned. In areas with snow, this is especially important. When the tree grows in a forested setting, this typically maintains a single tall stem and a much narrower form. Yellowwood has a small, scattered native range, as you can see by the range map. It's found in Kentucky, Tennessee, North Carolina, and scatterings along the Mississippi River Valley. In Kentucky, it is found in the east, but it's most common along the Kentucky River Palisades in the bluegrass region. It grows best in deep, well-drained soils of a medium pH, but tolerates both higher and lower pH levels. Yellowwood flowers best in full sun, but also grows well in a forested setting. It also does well in an urban setting and is somewhat air pollution and, and tolerant of salt. Yellowwood is deciduous with alternately arranged leaves, as you can see in the photo. The leaves are pinnately compound, which means they're composed of several leaflets arranged alternately along the leaf stem. The leaves have typically five to nine leaflets, but usually seven, and the leaves are eight to 12 inches long. The leaf petiole encloses the leaf bud, as you can see in the photo, and this is a good identifying characteristic. The leaves are green above and paler below, and the fall leaf color is a showy, clear yellow. Yellowwood can exhibit one of the most spectacular flowering displays of any tree species. Yellowwood has perfect flowers, which means they have both male and female reproductive structures. They are white, fragrant, and pea-like, and they grow in 8 to 15 inch long drooping structures or clusters. They look similar to wisteria flower. The flowers bloom in late spring to early summer after the leaves have emerged. Trees will produce a large number of flowers every other or every third year. The flowers are pollinated by bees. Yellowwood is a legume and the fruit is a flat brown pod. The pods are typically two to four inches long, and they contain small, brown, hard-coated seeds. The fruits ripen in early fall, and the pods tend to persist. The bark is smooth, often wrinkled, thin, and gray. Because the bark is thin, it can be easily damaged, and care must be taken when working around a yellowwood. Yellowwood is so named because the freshly cut heartwood is a muted to brilliant yellow color. The wood was prized by early gunsmiths for gun stocks. The wood was also used and still is for small specialty carved items. The root bark was used to make a yellow dye that early settlers used as a fabric dye. The national champion yellowwood is in Morris, New Jersey. It's 227 inches in circumference, 74 feet tall with a 78 foot crown spread. The Kentucky champion yellowwood is in Jefferson County at the Cave Hill Cemetery. It's 218 inches in circumference, 58 feet tall, with a 50 foot crown spread. If you'd like to know more about champion trees, check out American Forest National Register of Champion Trees, or check out the Kentucky Division of Forestry, Kentucky Champion Trees. Now for a few fun facts about yellowwood. Yellowwood was first described by the French botanist and explorer André Michaud in 1796 and was introduced into cultivation shortly thereafter. The scientific genus name for yellowwood, Cladrastis, is from the Greek klados and thraustus, which means branch and fragile, in reference to the brittle wood. The species name, Kentuckia, means of Kentucky. Yellowwood was formerly known as Cladrastis lutea, and lutea is from the Latin and means yellow, referring to the wood of the tree. Thanks for joining me today, and I hope you get the opportunity to get out into your woodland, local park, or neighborhood and enjoy the seasonal beauty of the outstanding yellowwood. 